Yo, what is up guys? So the brand new season started and we got all the rewards from the previous season. So I'll go over that really quick and then I will show you guys all of the new Rocket Pass stuff. And this decal right here, I think this is my favorite decal ever released in Rocket League, honestly. I don't think there's a decal in the game that beats this one right here. You can make your cart fully white at a certain point. It's kind of like Chameleon, but like way better. The car goes full white. It looks so nice. So I ended up getting myself a pair of white Zamas. I got my white Octane equipped. And it's like a full white ride. It looks super nice. And same thing with the blue one, dude. It looks so, so nice. I love the way it looks. So you'll definitely see me rocking this for a while. Absolutely love the way it's turned out. But anyway, I'm going to be showing you guys the rewards for the season. Where is it at? Also, I'm very sick at the moment. You can probably hear a bunch of sniffling throughout the video. And I'm trying my best not to sniffle too much, but just know that I am sick and I'm trying my best. So this is the bronze boost. This is the grand champ boost. This is the uh, gold boost, the diamond boost, and the champion boost. So I'm not a fan of them, I'll be honest, but nothing's ever really going to top alpha boost for me. As you can see, I have a lot of playtime on this. Um, but yeah, nothing's ever going to top that boost for me. But we'll go over the rocket pass items so you guys can have a look at those. I bought all the way to tier 70 already just because I wanted to get that decal. I fell in love with the decal the second I saw it. And I honestly, when I say this is my favorite decal that I've ever seen in this game, I mean it. It looks so nice. Like, I love how snow looks. And to me, it just looks like snow. <laughs> it just looks like your whole car is just like snowed out. So, yeah, I'll try to go through every single thing here. But, yeah, you don't need to spend a dime on this, honestly. Like... You don't need to like pay money to rank up. I feel like it's not even worth it. I normally get to like tier 300, 400 by the end of the season. Yeah, it looks super nice. So I'll probably use that for the video as well. Um, we got the starfish. You gotta love the starfish. The wheels don't look too fantastic, but there are quite a few pretty good looking decals. But the one that I'm using right now, easily, easily the best one. I think it's hard to top it. Um, but yeah. I'll just go through, I'll show you guys everything. But like I said, you guys all have this on your console. Like if you want to go look for yourself, you don't even have to have the tiers unlocked and you can look. Um, but yeah, if anything pops out to you and you want to work toward that tier, then definitely go for it. Like for me, the second I saw this decal, dude, that's the one thing that the only, literally the only reason why I wanted to uh, get all the tiers was just to get to that decal i think it's tier 40 something we'll see in a second also this is a brand new car i'll make a video on it and give you guys my thoughts but that'll probably be in a couple days so yeah this is a brand new car in the rocket pass <laughs> yeah like i said ignore my sniffles because not a whole lot i can do about it the wheels don't look terrible either there's, there's some wheels that are okay but some of them just look gross if i'm honest this is a pretty cool paint finish uh you can't see it right now because of the decal that i have on but i'll show you really quick I go over here. Where is it? It's called Obsidian. There. It looks pretty cool. I mean, I don't know. Kind of looks like scales. I'll use it in another video at some point. I won't make the video about the decal or about the pay finish, but I'll use it in another video. You'll see it at some point. We're going to use this for today. Let's go back to that. Where were we? Where were we? Tier 40 or something? Right here. Okay. So there's some gold explosions as well. We got this one. Dust cloud looks pretty nice. More banners. 10,000 XP. And this is the, the flash freeze decal. This is the decal that I absolutely fell in love with when I saw it. Easily my favorite. Like, I've said that before in videos. I've said this is definitely my favorite decal. But this, for sure, 100%, hands down, it's going to be hard to top this. The entire car turns white at a certain point during the decal's animation. That is something that you can't find in any other decal. If you stop right there, pause the video right there, it's full white. You see tiny little bits of blue, but besides that, it's the whitest you can get your vehicle. And it just looks so nice. It really pops out with the, the white zombies as well. These wheels are ugly as hell. Holy, it's an octopus. It's a pretty cool decal. I didn't even notice that one before. It's a nice little decal as well. Horns. A Dominus decal. Antennas? I don't know. I've never been one to use antennas, so... Doesn't really matter too much to me, but there might be some of you guys out there that do like antennas. If you're German, this is a pretty cool banner for you. But yeah, that's pretty much it. We're at tier 68 now. The gold explosion looks so nice though. I'm definitely gonna equip this one for the video. I might even use it more in the future as well. But this is the final version of 
the the car. And I noticed on the side it says RLCS Rumble, so I wonder if they're gonna bring like Minties and Mayhem back and have teams play Rumble against each other for money. That'd be pretty cool. But yeah, that's the last thing you can unlock in the Rocket Pass. I'm gonna play some ones placements for today because I haven't played any ones yet at all. So let's get into that and hopefully we can get some wins. Let's go. All right, for the first game of the video, we're playing against CM8. Let's see what we can do. Not sure what to expect out of these placement games. You either play somebody who's like absolutely insane. Or someone who's probably not actually at the rank that they're playing at. But we started off with a beautiful little flip reset there. Really good first goal to start it off. He's using the brand new car as well. My main focus is my kickoffs in ones always. That will always be one of the most important things in ones. If you have a good kickoff... Gonna help you out incredibly. That alone. Let's take this mid boost. I have time. Ball's bouncing pretty high here. I'll turn it quick. Just had to beat him to it. Ah, oh, couldn't get under it just enough. To get the shot on that. It's all good though. I have to wait for his dribble. So we got a challenge this. It's fine as well, I'll just wait. He was ready up for it. I knew his shot wasn't gonna be on target, so I didn't have to panic or anything. Wait for that to drop down. There we go. The goal explosion looks so cool. It reminds me of something, but I don't know what. I'm just gonna fake this gig off. There we go. I had a feeling he wouldn't challenge that based off like his car's body language. He's kind of waiting for the ball to come to him, so I knew I had time. I can't get a shot of this, but I can go for the boost at least. There we go. He made a pretty bad mistake on the wall there. He could have been a little bit more patient. He didn't have to rush for a challenge. I was going to play off whatever he did regardless. I think he kind of scared himself and made a touch he didn't really need to try to make. Good challenges. Ooh. I did not think that could probably be to be honest. He messed up his dribble pretty bad. The ball fell off his car super early, which pretty much at that point when the ball falls off someone's car, it's like you're green light the challenge the majority of the time, but. He won the 50 super hard. Was not expecting that at all. Didn't really make much sense to be honest, but well done for him to win it. Be patient on those. Majority of the time it'll either be over slightly, or you can save it pretty easily. He actually got back to that. Should be able to get back up though and score it. I'm pretty sure my shot was wide. I think it was hitting the crossbar down. Oh, never mind. It was in. It was a good save from him. Like I said, excuse me for the sniffles. Not feeling great. Been ill for a little bit now. But I wanted to make a video for you guys. Try to fake this. Dude, this car looks so nice. I like to hit it off the wall when I fake like that. And it just gives me a bouncing ball to work with. Then I would like to pop it up. And then just go for some sort of like air dribble over him or something. And even if it doesn't go straight in off of it, I can still make a play off of it and like shoot again. Force him to make mistakes. Because they have to jump to try to block it in a situation like that. And it's just a very, very tough spot to be in on defense. Very hard to save, even for pros. Like pros still struggle with that kind of stuff. So yeah, pretty good first game. We're almost at level 1000 as well, I just realized. We're 989, it's pretty nice. So nice little flip reset to start off the first game. Let's get into the next one, and hopefully we can end the episode with two dubs. Let's go. The last game of the video we're playing against, Otto. I'm going to start off with a fake again. I like to switch it up, getting their heads pretty early. I'm going to go for my classic double tap off of this. If he misses, there we go. I like to go for it. 
If I get the fake to work successfully, I just hit it off the wall and set myself up for one of those. If they jump early, I go for a double. If they don't jump early, I go for the bump. There's a lot of ways around it. You pretty much just react based off what they do. If you didn't jump early there, I would have went for the bump for sure. Should be to get back though. Mess that one up a little bit. Try to get a little too cheeky with it. I'm gonna make him think I ran out of boost or something. And then I'll go for an air dribble. I don't know, flip off this car. Oh, I didn't. Good recovery from him. I'm trying to just keep possession off of this. It's fine though. He didn't have much boost, so. Only real play here is to throw it away. I'm gonna win that 50 most of the time. If he has no boost, kinda has to let me win that 50. Hit up the wall. Oh, super close on the flip reset. I should be able to get back in time and I'll pick up about 36 boost. Off just pads. Let's try. I didn't really panic too hard on that because I knew he was too far. I'm gonna shoot it. Just throw it there and I play off his touch. And grab the boost. Now he landed in the goal, so. Gives me a good amount of space to work with and I can stay with the ball here. I just dribble around a bit. Stay controls. Really no rush to do anything right now. Oh, I'll try to get the air dribble bump. Oh no, <laughs> that's gonna be a goal. It's all good though. I like hit the ball in the bottom of my wheels. And it just slowed me down. This is a bad idea though. Almost had the air dribble bump. It was slightly off. He did get bumped, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I got the boost. That alone could make him score this. I didn't have a very good 50 angle on that, so I had to wait till I was close enough. There we go. Nice little air dribble. I'm very aerial based when I play ones. If you guys have watched me for a long time, you know that. I don't play ones like the conventional ones player would. I'm not afraid to take risks, and I go for some things that I probably shouldn't, but at the end of the day, I mean, it works. I'm gonna go for cheeky kickoff here. Ooh, is that the new kickoff strat? I'm not gonna go for this ball, he's probably gonna have that. I was waiting for the opportunity to challenge. I still have a good amount of boost here. You probably won't think I have much. I'm gonna act low. I'm gonna pretend like I don't have any. Let's see if this works. Yeah, he's gonna know I have a lot by now. I'm gonna make him steal that for me. Okay, it's not working. <laughs> he doesn't care. <laughs> I tried to bait him in to do something a little bit stupid, but he's not. Fifty? Oh, I was trying to block him in. I'll just play this high and then back off. Big challenge him. What can we do with this? The angle? There we go, that was nice. We get the Brazil, we have a minute 30. We need three goals. Uh, I wanted to think that I was faking it. I thought he was gonna slow down again. But he didn't that time. Let's try on the shot, it was a good turn. Ooh. I won't lie to you, I was trying to get a flip, and it would have been a goal regardless if I got the flip. But he had to try to block the, the flip angle. We could try from him. I feel like I should have got the flip out of that, but I might not hit the right part of my car, I guess. What the hell? That looks so weird. 
All right, 59 seconds for one goal. I'm gonna go fast kick off and then hopefully ceiling shot if I can get the fast kick off. No. He missed though, I think. Should be fine. I could jump for this and then just stay with this ball on the wall. Uh, I'll try to see if I can fake him again. I believe in the Brazil, dude. I never believed more. I'm waiting for his next touch here. Okay, it's fine. He just grabbed the beast, probably. Alright, air dribble bump. For the Brazil. Aw. Uh, took such a weird path onto the ball there. He's no boost. This is my time. I want the double. Uh, I didn't want to get like just the open net. Boring goal. No! <laughs> I was messing around too much at the end. I could have probably scored like three times, but it's alright. We're going for the style points. <laughs> but anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Got some nice goals. Nice little double tap there. It was a good flipper set as well in the first game. But yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you want to see me play next. I do have to do my placements for solo standard. Uh, standard and solo duel still so let me know what you guys want to see me play for a video if you guys want to see me try to get uh, my last game done for getting a grand champ for twos let me know if you want to see me see that as well I was also thinking about doing a road to grand champ starting soon it would be after DreamHack Montreal which would be next weekend after next weekend I'd start doing a road to grand champ but I don't know what mode to do it in and I don't know like how you guys want to want me to do that so I'm gonna do a poll over on Twitter asking about that um, in the next week or two. So if you're not following me on Twitter, definitely go follow me over there. Links always down below in the description. Help out with the poll, please. It helps a lot. Make sure you follow me on Twitter. And, you know, I always tweet out when I go live, stuff like that, and important polls like this for videos. So definitely go follow me over there. It'll help a lot with uh, what I decide to do with the series. So yeah, much love, guys. Thank you for supporting me as always. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a wonderful day. Peace.